Matt, you can't do this. You can't keep me locked in here. Adios, Cap. And then the Lord said to Noah, Enter the ark, you and all your household. For you alone I have seen to be righteous before me in this time. Matt, what are you talking about? I'm sorry, you Lieutenant. You can't! Colonel, wait! Hey! It's fine. It's fine. Ma'am, I got the, uh, supplies that you asked for. Come on in. Follow me. I've been working on a new assignment. Poison this time. Listen. When you pick this, you have to do it carefully. If you don't, it could kill you. Understood. Thank you. Yes, ma'am. St. John, this is Captain Curry. Come in. I'm here, Captain. The Colonel has asked to see you. You'll find him in his chambers inside the Ark. His chambers? If you go in from the main camp, past the first storage area, there's a passage off to the left. Okay, uh, any idea what he wants? Something about a duty roster. Don't keep him waiting, Corporal. No, sir. Your name has been mentioned for an important project coming up. Keep your nose clean, and there might be a promotion in your future. Yes, sir. Curry out. Important project? What project? Hey, sir, you there? Come in. Corporal St. John, I won't tolerate insubordination. Private, I'm trying to work. Get out! Sorry, ma'am. Colonel's orders. Gotta keep eyes on you 24 7. Uh, Lieutenant. Sorry. Yeah, just reporting in. Um, I got a question about your requisition form. Yes, Corporal. Uh, it says that you need me to collect water hemlock. Yes. It grows along the edges of wetlands. Look along the north edge of the Klamath Marsh. You should be able to find it there. Klamath Marsh. Got it. Remember, Corporal, it's highly poisonous. The most toxic plant that grows in North America. O okay, I'll be careful. And the last report said that there were infected crows in the area, so you might want to take something to burn out their nests. Burn out their nests. Got it. Uh, one more thing. Uh, that other project that I'm working on, I'm gonna have more information on that soon. Thank you, Corporal. Lieutenant Whitaker, out. I gotta need some shotgun ammo. Burn out the nests, get any Molotovs. Uh, sir, I was... You know when I was young? We used to explore caves like these. Looking for petroglyphs, carvings by the Modoc, other tribes. Thousands of years old. You know, they never lived in these caves, the heathens. In the cold and the dark. But look at us. Look how far we have fallen. Uh, Colonel, Colonel, I, I was... The soldier who used to be assigned to Lieutenants Whitaker and Weaver, the soldier you replaced, has gone AWOL. He broke into my private chambers and took my personal copy of the Holy Bible. I want it returned. Yes, sir. I've marked his last known location on your map. Dismiss, Corporal. A short while ago, I stood here before you and grieved for the loss of Captain Jimenez, our only doctor and my very dear friend. And for what great purpose did Captain Jimenez perish? So that a drug addict, a worthless excuse of a human being, could get high. Jimenez died because he stood between a junkie 
and a bag full of narcotics. I have taken steps to see that this never happens again. For their own safety, I have moved Lieutenants Whitaker and Weaver into the Ark, where they will be under protective watch 24 hours a day. The call is going out. Any person who has highly trained knowledge and skills, skills that cannot be replaced, mechanics, engineers, scientists, medical personnel, are to be taken from active duty and removed to the Ark until this war is over. From now on, no one is allowed entrance into the Ark unless they are on special assignment and unless they are personally vetted by myself. There will be no exceptions. I am beginning to see, I'm afraid, that our enemy has never been the freaks. They know not what they do. Mankind, in all his state of degradation and transgression, is our true enemy. Keep a watchful eye on your neighbors. Evil surrounds us. Company dismissed. Okay, Private Myers, where the hell are you? Colonel Garrett? Sir? Corporal. St. John, is it? Yes, sir. I, uh, I tracked down that AWOL soldier, Private Myers, and here is your Bible. And God Almighty shall have the final word. Did you bring him back alive? 
We have a noose waiting for him in the staging area. Uh, no, sir. Um, the anarchists got to him before I did, and they tortured him to death. Unfortunate. But God's will is God's justice. Uh, yes, sir. Carry on, Corporal. Hey, Weaver. Oh, Corporal St. John. Come on in, man. Check out my home sweet home. Yeah, I love what you've done with the place. Man, ain't I... this some shit? Wonder what they would have done with me if I failed. No, oh, colder cave down that way. <laughs> yeah. I heard about that. You know, she didn't take it any better than I did. No, she did not. Do you need anything? Nah, man, I'm good. Oh, wait, you know what? There is something you can get from me. You hear that? Hear what? That's right. Nothing. Colonel ain't exactly big on tunes, in case you hadn't heard. I think it's Mennonite or some shit. Oh, it's dancing. Wait, what's dancing? Dude, Mennonites, they love music. They just have a problem with dancing. Forget it. Oh, it's... no shit. Yeah, whatever, dude. I don't care. I need an MP3 player. Earbuds. Anything. Sounds. Are you kidding me? Do I look like I'm kidding? Okay. Thank you. Weaver. Yeah, I can barely hear you though. You're breaking up. This is damn cave. And I'm surprised the signal gets out at all. Hey, I know where you can find an MP3 player. Okay, yeah, where's that? I was at a refugee camp at a community college when they got overrun. Community college? Uh, the one east of here off Highway 97? Yeah, that's the one. Home of the fight and platypus and some shit. Yeah, anyway, when I walked back, I left everything behind, including my tool. Shit, I gotta go. Ready me when you get there. Weaver out. Uh, sure, Weaver, whatever you say. O'Brien? Come in, O'Brien. I know you're on this channel. Drifter? I didn't think I'd ever hear from you again. The radio's been dead. Yeah, I turned it off. Look, I need your help. I'm listening. My wife, the woman you helped me track down. I remember. Found her, O'Brien. She's alive. That's incredible. The odds of her making it out. No, I, look, I don't have time. Look, I found her. She's alive. And she's being held by uh, the militia. The guys that you told me about. I'm sorry. Okay, look, I don't need your goddamn sympathy. I need your help. She's being held in a place. I can't get to her. I need you to help me to break her out. You know I can't do that. Wait a second. Okay, but there's something you have to do for us first. You name it, I will do anything. Keep your radio on this time. I'll be in touch. Okay, O'Brien. O'Brien! Oh, damn it! Weaver, I'm here. St. John! All right, man. Uh, hey, I was housed in some kind of tent. It was like right in the middle of camp. Okay. Ah, uh, can you tell me anything else? I mean, come on, these all kind of look the same. Wait, 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 uh... Yeah, 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 it was near a flagpole, a big one. They're flying the good old stars and stripes. Oh, very patriotic. All right, well, I'll have a look. St. John out. Lord.
Here, here it is. I hope it's worth all this trouble, Weaver. Hey. Hey, man, how'd you do? Uh, this is all I could find. Oh, oh man, what do we have here? Oh, brother, you're a lifesaver, dude. Right on. Thank you. Uh, do you need anything else, Weaver? Weaver, do you need... Totally. Mm, mm. Hey, Corporal St. John, you one of the good ones, man. Brother from another mother. Brian! Okay, where the hell have you been? Meet me at the coordinates I've just transmitted. O'Brien out. O'Brien. O'Brien, how? Oh. Jesus, he's... Damn it. So, uh, what do you want from me, O'Brien? I'm glad she's alive, your wife. Okay, what, what do you want? I told you the infected, the freaks are mutating, some faster than others. Uh -huh. We placed a tracking bracelet on one of them so that we could track it and stop it periodically and draw blood samples and check the progress of the virus. Okay, so why do you need me? Well, it's wandered into militia territory. Oh, right. We can't get close to it. Yeah, no fly zone, outpost with RPGs. Exactly. What's this? Once you've tracked it down, I'm gonna need you to do something for me. This pack holds everything you need to do a field biopsy. We need blood and tissue samples. Can you handle that? Yeah, I can figure it out. By the way, nice uniform, Corporal. Suits you. Suck it. <laughs> the tracking signal is coming from somewhere around Mount Scott. There's a cave. The subject you're tracking has a super-elevated metabolism. We think it might be headed there. There's something else we'd like you to check. We did send a team in, on foot. They never came back. Just let me know if you find them. We got people here looking for some closure. So, uh, what else can you tell me about this freak you're tracking? We don't have all the answers. All we know is that the infected are mutating. We're talking about leaping past millions of years of evolution. We think they're communicating with each other the way ants and bees and, and other... You know, to me, sounds like a whole lot of mumbo-jumbo. Believe what you want. Once you see our test subject, you'll change your mind. O'Brien out. Brian, I'm at the cave and I'm heading in. You guys gonna be ready? Yes, we're standing by. Oh, Jesus. What's wrong? Eh, freaker shit. Freaker shit everywhere. Hey, O'Brien, uh, you got any idea what took out your men? Am I walking into a horde here? No idea. We never heard back from them. Remember, if you find them, we 
got people here who'd be grateful. Grateful? Grateful, yeah, that changes everything. Yeah, I got it. Good. I'll take care of it out. O'Brien, how many men are in here? Uh, how many did you, did you lose? Four. Four men. A researcher and three soldiers. Jesus, O'Brien, what am I doing in here? The researcher, Coop, is a personal friend of mine. You do this and I'll do whatever I can to help you get your wife, O'Brien, out. O'Brien. So while I'm tracking down your pet freak, give me some more mumbo jumbo. Uh, tell me about the virus. I mean, something that I don't know. For those exposed, the virus infection rate is close to 100%. In the first weeks, almost everyone under the age of 12 was killed. Something to do with how puberty or the lack of it affected the body's immune response. Everyone over the age of 60 mostly were also killed. Their bodies just couldn't handle the rapid genetic mutations on a cellular level. Everyone else who is exposed becomes transformed as the genes mutate. The thing is, the virus is mutating at an exponential rate. I know you keep saying that. What does that mean? It means that the infected subject, the freaker you're tracking down, isn't like any you've seen before. We've tracked and identified over 12 mutations. 12? Yeah. And that's just the beginning. You wouldn't believe some of the shit we've seen. Yeah, well, probably would. Say, John, out. Flare. Shit, that's gotta be one of O'Brien's men. Uh, hey, you, up there, can you hear me? O'Brien, I see one of your men. not answering, and, uh, he's on a ledge above me. I'll see if I can get up to him. If you can, retrieve his ID badge. Yeah, yeah, I'll get right on that. St. John out. How the hell am I gonna get up there? Guys in yellow spacesuits. Can't be too hard to find them if they're in here. Says G. Hernandez. How did it happen? Well, I'm not a coroner, O'Brien. How the hell do I know? Something tore him apart. Uh, this freak I'm tracking. Is there something you haven't told me? Not that I'm aware of. O'Brien out. Cooper, Cooper. Hey, 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 right here, right here. We're gonna get you out of here right now. Cooper! Cooper, come in! Sorry, shoot. Where's Seth? He's down. Come on. Oh, Jesus. What's going on, Deacon? Cooper! His legs are broken. Hold on, stay with him. I'm sending in another team. No, no, no. My 
It's compromised. I'm not gonna make it. Let me talk to Jen. Get Jen in here now! Cooper, what the hell did this to you? What happened? It was so fast. I didn't see it coming. You told me that a freak did all of this. Reacher. Reacher. Cooper! Cooper, are you there? Jen? I'm here. I can't hear you. I can't believe it. I thought I'd never hear you more. So what the hell am I dealing with here? Brian, talk to him. The guy's in the lab, nicknamed it the Reacher. Reacher? What, it, it's got long arms, claws, what? No, it's just... fast. We've clocked it from 30 years The Reacher should have a tracking device. Take it. To take it, we can use it to guide you out. What? How? How, O'Brien? We can track the horde's movements. Take it! <sighs> oh, Jesus. I hope this was worth it, O'Brien. O'Brien, I got your samples. Say, John, get out of there! What? Thanks to you. Transmitting coordinates. O'Brien out. O'Brien. Four men died from this shit. Hope it was worth it. Jesus, listen to you. Those are my men. I don't need you or anyone else telling me. Fly around in your helo well above the shit. You crawl back into what? 
cozy underground bunker, or whatever the fuck. You have no idea what it's like out here. I don't have to what listen to shit. Survive. Oh, you know those men, Cooper? The others, they had no idea what they were walking into, but you did. Didn't you? Huh? Didn't you? Radio me when you and your old lady are ready to be lifted up. Maybe this time you'll get on the chopper with her. Pretty much looks like a marsh. Let's go look. Well, would you like to taste it? Go right ahead. Thank you, Corporal. I hope you were careful. This is very toxic. Yeah. Yeah, sure thing, ma'am. Uh, listen, I got a plan. I don't have time to explain, but the next time I get here, get ready to get the hell out of here, okay? Corporal. I didn't thank you this time. As you were. Boozer, you there? Lost Lake Camp, come in. Deke! That's good to hear from you, brother. How's it going? Yeah, it's, uh, everything's fine. Booze, man, it's, uh, I'm okay. Yeah? Bullshit. How long did we ride together? What's going on, brother? Uh, I, look, Sarah, it's a long story, but she's, she's part of the militia down here. She wants to come back with me, but... Now they, uh, they're forcing her to stay, booze man. They're not gonna let us leave. What the hell? Forcing you to stay? Jesus, Dean. Where are you? Okay, I'm gonna grab Iron Mike, uh, uh, Ricky, some men. Look, we'll find a way down there. We'll, we'll... Boozer, no. No, you don't understand. They got hundreds of men, and they are armed. Shit, they stole from the National Guard, the military, the... the... I don't give a shit what they've got. We're gonna... God damn it, listen to me. You, we cannot let the Colonel, their leader, find out about Lost Lake. He's crazy, Boozer, batshit fucking crazy. The militia, they're attacking every camp that they come across. Drifters, squatters, campers, makes no difference to them. Oh, Jesus, Dick. Look, I got this. I got this figured out. Just if anything happens to me, if, if you don't hear from me again, then... Dick, I'm... Think you're gonna figure this out, like you said. Okay, you, you get Sarah, and you get her the hell out of there, you hear me? Yeah, booze man, I hear you. All right, that's more like it. Now no, you're cutting out of me. I can't. Deke? Deke? I hear you, brother. I hear you. Deke and out. I have had a revelation. Last night, a new group of recruits joined our ranks and have already been sworn in. They have traveled far, from the east, west, south, and north. They're coming to this place. At this time, is no accident. They bring word of more camps, like the one to the south, which we have purged. Camps filled with degenerates, thieves, drug addicts, and murderers. We are threatened, all of us. Every day, 
we live in the shadow of death. But that shadow is not cast by rabid freaks that surround us. They are part of God's plan. They are part of God's punishment. No! No. It is not the freaks who threaten to destroy us. It is our fellow man. Yes, sir. Like Noah before us. We have built an ark to save mankind. To save all the knowledge. So when the flood waters recede, we may rebuild. But in this age, here at the end of the world, God is not sending the oceans from their beds to rise up and sweep away the damned. There will be new baptism of water. No. In this last age, we are the flood. We are sent forth to baptize the world with fire! the depraved and cleanse the St. John come in. Okay, I hope you're ready because we're doing this. We're doing this right now. Give me your coordinates. Done. Wait, where are you? Center of Crater Lake, Wizard Island, and Militia Camp. You've disabled the RPGs? Ah, oh, shit, not yet. I'll get right on that. Radio me when you're ready. I'll bring it out. Gotta get to the RPGs. Where would they be? Oh, the towers. There's gotta be the towers. That's right. Keep moving. Speech? Move it against other camps? <laughs> Jesus, that's harsh. Find me some grub while you're out. Yeah. Come well, on, you son of a bitch. That'll do it. I gotta get to Sarah. Sarah, uh, Lieutenant Whitaker, come in. Damn it. Hang on, I'm coming. Can't you stand guard or do whatever it is you're doing out there? Colonel's orders. Gotta keep eyes on you at all times. Yeah, well, fuck the Colonel's orders. Hey, you watch your mouth. Things are changing around here. And if you don't follow the orders... <laughs> Make sure we're clear. You're good. You're clear. Okay. That's the plan. I need you to pack your stuff. We're leaving. How are we gonna get out of here? There are guards everywhere. Do you trust me? O'Brien. Well, I'm here. We're heading up to the cone. We got one shot at this. Copy that. O'Brien out. Who's O'Brien? Where are we going? Look, I don't have time to explain. You got everything? We're not coming back. Yeah, I'm ready. Let's go. Right, stay close. And if we see anyone... Hey. In case you didn't read my note. So who's O'Brien? How's he getting us out of here? I told you, O'Brien is how I found you. He was the Nero soldier who was there that night, the night that I put you on that chopper. Nero? Oh, shit, Weaver. No, 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 that one. The canister. Right. Private, are you paying attention? Eyes on your work, man. That canister, right there. I don't want to see that canister fall. Holy shit, he let us go. Weaver let us go. Oh shit, more guards. Okay, hold here. Let's go around him. Okay. So, Brian, the guy in the near chopper, he 
He's coming here? Yeah, look, it's a long story. I'll tell you all about it once we get clear. Wait, so they're still flying? I mean, God, Deacon, they must have resources, labs, equipment? Well, yeah, I, I'm pretty sure they do. Look, you can ask O'Brien when you see him. Another guard. Hold on. I'll distract him. Yeah, I'll be careful. Soldier, what are you doing? I'm sorry, man. This area is off limits. How dare what? you talk back to an officer? What? What? <laughs> nice. Another guard. I'll see if I can get them to move. Yeah, I'll be careful. <laughs> well done. Come on. We're almost there. Boozer again. You, uh, you want to go with me to Lost Lake? I mean, I, mean, I, th I thought we were going to Cloverdale. No, we are. I mean, I just want to see him. He's like my big brother. It's not like we have much family left these days, you know. Wait, I'll distract him. I saw someone. Soldier, over here, please. Ma'am, this is restricted. Are you questioning me, soldier? Do you see this? <laughs> <one>? <laughs> Good work. Yeah, well, we make a good team. I can see daylight. Come on, we're almost out. Yeah, okay, this is it. We're at the cone. Okay, we made it. Where's it? Where is he? Where's O'Brien? Oh, he'll be here, he'll be here. We just, uh, oh, need to... Gentlemen, this is the top of the cone where you can see we get an amazing view here. Oh, Lieutenant. I've just been giving this group of new recruits a tour of the island. Oh, we're just about to go down into the Ark. You should join us. Uh, well, uh, gentlemen, Colonel... this is Lieutenant Whitaker. She heads up part of the research team that's exploring ways to use poison to defeat our enemies. Traitor! He's a murderer run. and a spy. Why would you, you listen to him over me? Remember that camp I told you about? You know I am not. like the leader of that camp. Lost Lake oh, sent him here. this is full of shit. I'm telling I'm, you. I've never even met this motherfucker. Colonel, you've got to believe me. Enough! All right. I'm listening. I am telling you, he is a spy. Matt, this mm -hmm. guy's crazy. You've never seen him before. Yeah. He comes out of nowhere lying. and you're going to believe what, him? What's that you camp you're I'm saying lying. I'm from? You think Lost I'm lying? Is that it? I'm not lying. Have him show us your back. Yeah. Huh? Show us enough, your back. Enough, enough! That's my last warning. Now we will get to the truth of this matter. Thou shalt not bear false witness against thy neighbor. Captain Khoury, I forget, is that the 8th or the 9th commandment? I don't rightly recall, sir. Tell me what you saw, and don't lie to me, son. I'll know. At Lost Lake Camp, he attacked a woman. What the fuck are Barbara! you talking? He wasn't wearing a shirt. Son of a bitch has a tattoo covering his back. It's some satanic shit. It's some kind of dog, a dead dog chewing through a chain or something, like it was nothing. I, I pulled him off her. He was drunk and we fought like hell, but who knows what wouldn't have happened if I hadn't been there. You make him show us his back, and you will see who's lying. I'm sorry, Colonel. This shit is just so crazy. <clears throat> Turn him. <clears throat> you wear the image of Cerberus, the Hound of Hades. How fitting that you were discovered ascending from the underworld. But you are not Cerberus, are you? Deacon St. John. He's lying. You hide behind angelic names of the truth and tell the truth. Is. Is. He got kicked out you of the You are Judas! Of the and what about you, Lieutenant? How convenient that you were with the Drifter when the Nero helicopter came by. 
Colonel, I do not know what you're talking about. You were in a Nero camp that was overrun! How long have you been spying on us? How long? Matt, I promise, I haven't been- More lies! I expect this from drifters. I expect men like him to betray me! The officer? Colonel, it was me! Uh, it was me! Colonel, I lied. If you look in my pocket, you're gonna find a radio. Because I called them. I called them and I lied. I lied to the lieutenant. I told her that uh, I needed her to help me check a shipment, but the truth is I just needed a hostage. Deacon St. John, Drifter, are you there? This is Nero. This is O'Brien, Drifter. I'm sorry. Corporal St. John is unavailable right now. Wait. Who is this? Sometimes, in the search for truth, the blood of innocence is spilled. I'm sorry, my dear. Release Private uh, Zarkowski, was it? Yeah. And Corey, take this drifter to lockup. Tomorrow at 0700, he will stand trial. And he will hang. <laughs> Lieutenant, enough of this. We have work. Tell me more about this Lost Lake camp. Yes, sir. Anything you want to know. Lieutenant! Please. Come on. Get up. Uh, 